Hello students, in this video we are going to discuss 3.7 from motion in a plane. Given a bar plus b bar plus c bar plus d bar is equal to 0, which of the following statements are correct? A, a bar, b bar, c bar and d bar must each be a null vector b the magnitude of a bar plus c bar equals the magnitude of b bar plus d bar the magnitude of a bar can never be greater than the sum of the magnitudes of b bar c bar and d bar d b bar plus c bar must lie in the plane of a bar and d bar if a bar and d bar are not collinear and in the line of A bar and D bar if they are collinear. Coming to the solution of A. The statement A bar, B bar, C bar and D bar must each be a null vector to satisfy A bar plus B bar plus C bar plus D bar is equal to 0. So, this statement is not correct. Because A bar B bar C bar and D bar need not each be a null vector. Here in the question he asked correct statement or incorrect statement. He did not ask explanation but I am giving the explanation. It is additional information. The resultant of four non zero vectors can be a null vector in many ways. Coming to B, the magnitude of A bar plus C bar equals the magnitude of B bar plus D bar. So, this statement is correct. Answer is correct. How can we justify A bar plus B bar? plus c bar plus d bar is equal to given as 0. From this we can write a bar plus b bar is equal to minus of here as mentioned a and c a bar plus c bar. So I am writing here a bar plus c bar is equal to minus of b bar plus d bar according to the given data I have taken. From this if you take the magnitude of a bar plus c bar is equal to the magnitude of b bar plus d bar. We can write like this. So, you mentioned the magnitude of a bar plus c bar equals the magnitude of b bar plus 
d bar so the statement will be correct and this is the justification coming to c according to c the magnitude of a bar can never be greater than the sum of the magnitudes of b bar c bar and d bar so this statement also correct here we can write the justification a bar plus b bar plus c bar plus d bar is equal to a null vector from this we can write a bar is equal to minus of b bar plus c bar plus d bar and if you write the magnitude we can write a is equal to b bar plus mod b bar plus c bar plus d bar but here a is equal to b bar plus c bar plus d bar under mod we can take it so therefore the magnitude of vector a bar is equal to the magnitude of vector b bar plus c bar plus d bar the sum of the magnitudes of vectors b bar c bar and d bar may be greater than or equal to that of vector a bar but so the magnitude of vectors b bar c bar and d bar on be less than the magnitude of a bar coming to d b bar plus c bar must lie in the plane of a bar and d bar if a bar and d bar are not collinear and in the line of a bar and d bar if they are collinear so this statement also correct again we will write a bar plus b bar plus c bar plus d bar is equal to 0 that means here b bar plus c bar if you are taking b bar plus c bar can be is equal to minus of a bar plus d bar that so we can write 
द रिजल्टेंट ऑफ और द रिजल्टेंट सम ऑफ थ्री वेक्टर्स b bar plus c bar a bar and d bar can be zero only if b bar plus c bar is in the plane of a bar and d bar that means b bar plus c bar a bar and d bar should be coplanar vectors in case a bar and d bar r collinear then b bar plus c bar must be in line of a bar and d bar so this is the justification according to the question we need to identify which statements are correct which statements are wrong here which of the following statements are correct is mentioned so first statement is not correct second statement is correct statement 3 also correct and uh, statement d also correct actually this is the answer i have given the justification for this thank you